Welcome back. You're invited to watch my newest uh, service post from the vintage Nike sewing machines. Um, in this video I will show you how to unfreeze a needle bar if your machine is sitting for many years and not be used for a long time um, it's maybe have some problems with the mechanics inside and there's a the old oil got stocked and you have um, problems with the needle bar okay um this in this machine is absolute okay um it will work fine uh, if i push the level it turns back into the position here's the needle bar you can see the moving this is a spring-loaded mechanism the needle bar will switch back into the left position by himself. Mm. Okay, um, let's have a look at the machine is sitting for many years and has uh, problems with the needle bar. It's a very clean machine but if he push here there's no moving of the needle bar I have to push it and pull it back this uh, tired mechanic um, here's the level for the needle position Now there's no self moving to the left position. That means that the bearings downwards and, and the upper side here are stocked with old oil. Um, first we have to remove the top cover of the machine please use a screwdriver that sized exactly by the screw second we remove the front door so now you can see this area here. Um, what we try to do is um, heat up the this part and down there um, with a burner like this. That's fine. Oh, watch this. I burned off my cable there. 
I'm so stupid, sorry. So, maybe it works. Yeah. Um, this little heating will be <coughs> okay. Um, needle bar is moving now by himself. I've got here a problem with my cable. I burn it the uh, cable down. Hope this is no problem. Okay, that's it. <clears throat> For lubricating I use um, steering power oil. I have here an injection needle. And I put a little drop there. There. And there. Okay, that's it. Okay, um, I'm so sorry for burning up this cable. 